Looking day ahead of us, we'll enjoy a lot of sunshine with less wind than we experienced on uh, Tuesday. We had gusts to 40 miles per hour but before we even got to noon yesterday. But then things uh, dropped off nicely in the evening. And now this morning we wake up actually at just slightly below freezing levels. Uh, temperatures seasonably chilly, but not brutally cold by any means. And certainly no wind chill impact to speak of. Here's a look southward. That's our Lewis did auto camera from downtown Rochester. It's 32 degrees right now. The weather patio in northwest Rochester. The winds are light from northwest at two miles per hour. So the wind chill not far from the actual temperature. Air pressure is steady 29 98 right now. Temperatures mostly 20s to around 30. Dodge Center just a little warmer. It's 32 there, but Rochester Airport 30. It's 32 in Preston, 30 degrees in Charles City, Mason City 28. You factor the winds and not much wind to speak of. Eight mile per hour winds. That's not that bad. We could handle this. At this point yesterday, we were already getting 20 mile per hour gusts. And at this point, we only had temperatures in the mid teens. And so it was feeling a lot colder today. The wind chill 22. Not all that hard to manage this morning. Air pressure is rising. As a weak cold front works its way through the area as we speak, here's future track satellite radar front pushing southward behind it. High pressure will continue to build in over the next several hours and stick around for a few days, bringing us quiet, tranquil weather and progressively warmer temperatures. Right now it's 30 at the Rochester Airport, 37 in Chicago, St. Louis 41, and Sioux Falls now 30 and 17 in International Falls, a, a place that has been sub-zero as recently as yesterday. But uh, things are looking better overall at this point for everybody. We'll have some sunshine, a mild day a light breeze look for temperatures in the low and maybe even mid 40s in a couple of spots next few days will be a, a slow low, slowly warming anyway a, a slow build up of progressively warmer temperatures in fact getting close to 50 by sunday it will be in the low 50s at least to start next week i don't think we're going to stay there permanently but i do think at least the next six or seven days we are looking at a warm trend that carries us into those almost early april like 50s for the morning commute Sunshine, a few passing clouds, 30 for that morning commute. A light northwest breeze around 6 miles per hour. Day planner today, some sunshine throughout the day. A few passing clouds, high temperatures around 41 this afternoon. Uh, and the wind chill uh, generally in the 30s to around 40 with a fairly light breeze. Uh, here's future track that front pushes southward. A light north breeze follows plenty of sunshine. A few passing clouds, especially around that front this morning into the early afternoon. Tonight and tomorrow, a spot or two of fog is possible after midnight with some stratus clouds developing. And then more of that sunshine and uh, just a few of those fair weather clouds through tomorrow into eventually Friday. As on the back side of that high pressure uh, coming out of the Canada, it will be more of a southerly fetch. That wind drawing in slightly warmer air. And as we melt more of that snow also, that will be another uh, element uh, in favor of a warm up as we see more of that uh, bare ground and lose some of that snow cover and the ground is allowed to warm up a little more quickly each day. Next rain chance, the only precipitation chance we have to speak of is Tuesday of next week. And then after that, we do have maybe more of a busy pattern with gradually cooler weather. But until then, Looking at some uh, abnormally warm weather. Temperatures today in the low 40s, Rochester 41, 49 in Mason City, though, 48 in La Crosse. Sunshine, a few passing clouds, a light northwest breeze around 3 to 8 miles per hour. Tonight, partly cloudy, 26, maybe a spot or two of fog. And seven day forecast, temperatures warming a little more each day, reaching the 50s by Sunday, and chance of rain in mid 50s by next Tuesday. That's almost April like weather there. That's pretty great.